welcome back my kinky and queens it is queen of queen she mean as you can see i'm loving my hair today i am going to be reviewing and demoing the by may beautiful purifying collection that i received from an instagram giveaway recently so you guys already know that i start off with a pre-poo and a hot oil treatment and so right here i'm just rinsing out the product Okay, so I'm going to start off with the purifying cleanser. It contains sea kelp, aloe, lemon, and cucumber. And also it contains no sulfates and also no parabens. And it is a 13 fluid ounce container. And it is a clear yellow consistency. And I love the smell of this, you guys. Oh my gosh. It smells so good. A little goes a long way. As you can see, it says on its own but my scalp felt so clean you guys like and my hair felt lightweight as well after using this on my hair so I could tell it had cleansed my hair strands. So I'm just going to rinse that out. Next we're going to go in with the purifying rinse. Now this contains apple cider, vin apple cider vinegar, aloe and cucumber. Also, this contains no sulfates and no parabens, and it is an eight ounce container. I love that it had a twist top on it, and that um, also with this, a little goes a long way as well. It provides great slip, and it also made my curls clump up as well. That's what I really liked about it. So now we're going to go in with the detox mask. It contains shea butter, sea kelp, aloe, and cucumber as well. And it is a 12 fluid ounce container. Look at my hair, you guys. I just wanted to show you how clean it was and just how light and bouncy it was. Like I noticed a difference in my texture. I just really enjoyed how my hair felt. It was just really soft and it felt really, really clean. And I just really enjoyed it a lot. My hair really did feel like it was detox. Like it really did. So I'm just going to take a very significant amount of the detox mask and just slap it on there. You guys know I love deconditioners. I never skip this step and it is a very important part of my natural hair care regimen. So this is how my hair looks. It's clumping up. I love it Ugh, and it smells so good. I feel like I was just on like a vacation somewhere. Okay, so now that we have applied the detox mask to all four sections of my head, we are going to go ahead and sit under my hooded dryer. And you guys, I love this thing. I got it for like $42 at the hair store. So for 30 minutes, you're just going to set your timer and just sit under there and just kind of like let it bake and let it marinate and do its own thing. And you can also use this as a steam mask as well. So that's pretty neat. Um, if you don't follow me on social media, I suggest you do on Instagram at Queen she Me. You guys know I love Instagram. So to just kind of speed things up, I went ahead and I just already started twisting a majority of my hair. It's just a setting style. You guys know I love the two strand twist, but as you can see, my hair is very juicy. So what I just typically do is just parted my hair into the normal small sections that I usually do. So, but as you can see, my hair is very light and bouncy. It was very clean. So I'm going to go in with the Curls Blueberry Bliss um, Leave-In Cream. I think it's called the Twist and Shout Cream. And um, I've used this before and um, I don't know why I haven't been using it, but I fell in love with it again. So you see me using that here today. <laughs> There's Alexa. You guys haven't seen her in a while. As you can see, her hair is growing as well. Hi, Poop. So now we're going to go in with some almond oil. I've just been obsessing over this oil lately and just do the praying hand method. Now we're going in with the replenishing styling cream. Oh my gosh, you guys, I feel in love with this stuff. It is so 
freaking good. It has a very nice, rich consistency to it. And oh my gosh, a little goes a long way. And I'm telling you, it coats the strands. I would just suggest make sure that you really work it into your hair. Don't just slap it on top and just go over it a couple times. No, make sure you massage it into every single strand and then do the praying hand method. And I just went in with some edge control because I decided I was not going to sit under the dryer again. So slap some of that Cantu styling edge control on there and I've been loving this stuff lately it's like four dollars at um Dollar General so you can pick that up there and then I'm just going to go ahead and just do my normal two strand twist And just make sure when you're doing your two strand twist that you're smoothing each strand every time you slide in your hands down your hair when you're twisting. That just helps to make sure that it, everything is smooth and even. And then also too, you won't have a lot of frizz when you're taking down your hair as well. I need to trim my ends, you guys. But as you can see, I was listening to something good, some kind of music. I don't know what it was. <laughs> So I'm just going to repeat the same process throughout the rest of my hair in the remaining sections. I'm just going to go in with a leave-in, my oil, and my cream like I typically do. But you guys, I really did love this purifying from by May Beautiful. I really enjoyed it. And this is the Pure Collection, the purifying cleanser. And this is the one that detox the hair. I really enjoyed it. My hair really needed it. And I really didn't even notice this, honestly, that it really needed to be cleansed. So as you can see, this is the remaining, um, this is the final product after using the collection. I was really, really impressed with the collection, you guys. And I haven't wanted to try this brand for a while, but I was just lucky enough to become an Instagram winner. And this is how I wore my hair for that day. Oh my gosh. It was so cute and my hair smelled so good. You could smell it with the wind blowing. I love that. So you guys know I love rocking my lippy. So we're just going to go on about the day. So you guys know that I'm going to share with you the takedown process, of course, so that we can see the definition. Look at how my hair is so defined. Now some people may not like to separate as much as I am doing just this particular day. I just decided to do it this way because my hair was dry um, because this is the day after I have actually washed my hair. So it is thoroughly dry and it is really ready for takedown. So I just make sure I apply a little bit of oil to my fingers and then I start the takedown process and you just want to separate naturally where it wants to. But I need to trim my ends because I was struggling with taking down my hair in the back. So um, if you notice that, just know that you need to trim your hair. So I did trim my hair. <laughs> There's Alexa again. But yeah, I just really enjoyed this collection, you guys. Like, look at this definition. It was just so clumpy. It was so nice. The separation was easy. My hair was soft. And I just really, really, really enjoyed it. And I was so happy that I got my hands on it. <laughs> Look at that definition. Look at that definition.
so this is the final product my king and queens again i'm so glad i tried this out my hair was refreshed it was light it was bouncy it was fluffy and it had a lot of shine to it as well so i hope you enjoyed this review and demo my king and queens if you did give this video a thumbs up and subscribe and i'll see you in my next upload be blessed